Hey guys, Garrett here with Zebco. Today I want to run you through how to rig up some of the tackle and how to set up the combo that comes in the 33 micro Bitsy kit. So to set up the combo, after you remove the rod and the reel from the flatboard, you want to take the reel and unscrew the top of the reel seat and then place the reel in the reel seat and screw that back down to secure the reel. Next, you want to take the tip section of the rod and insert it into the butt section of the rod and then extend the telescoping section out. And be careful to make sure that the guides are lined up in a straight line. Now after you have your rod together, the first thing you're going to want to do is press the button and then pull out this tab and it comes off. Next you'll want to pull some line out and then string it through the guides. So now I'm going to show you how to tie on the Bitsy Pond Minnow. But on this bait, I like to use the clinch knot because there's multiple treble hooks involved and it won't get hung up when you're trying to tie the bait on. So what I like to do, you take the end of the line and you run it through the split ring on the front of the crankbait. Then you take the tag end and you wrap it around the main line five times. And then you take the end of the line and you run it through the loop at the bottom of the knot. Then you wet it, pull it tight, cinch it down, make sure to clip your tag in, and then you're ready to fish. All right guys, so now I'm gonna show you how to fish some of these baits in the kit. First, I'm gonna start with the Bitsy Pond Minnow. This bait's gonna be great for targeting bluegill, crappie, small bass, um, any kind of game fish that roam around in the shallows, it's gonna be great for. So what I like to look for when I'm fishing this is rocky spots. Um, like I've got around me, there's timber everywhere, so I can cast this around pieces of timber um, and hopefully trigger a, a strike off of one of these targets. So to fish this bait, I'm just gonna press the button on my 33 micro. I'm gonna take the rod back and follow through with my cast and release the button on my follow through. Next, you'll wanna just make a steady retrieve with this bait. Be careful not to reel too fast because the bait could turn on its side, but you'll just keep a slow to medium retrieve. All right, so now I'm gonna show you how to rig one of these Bitsy tubes that comes in the 33 micro Bitsy kit. It's very simple. All you have to do is turn the tube upside down and then take your jig head and slide it in until it reaches the head of the tube and then poke the eye of the hook out and you're ready to tie it on. I like to tie a Palomar knot. I double the line and then I run it through the eye of the hook and then I tie a simple overhand knot and then you're left with a tag end and a loop. I just run the bait back through the loop, wet the line and pull it tight and then clip the tag end off and you're ready to fish. All right, so now I'm gonna show you how to fish the Bitsy tube on the tour grade Kraken tube head. What I'm gonna look for when I'm fishing this is shoreline cover like I've got here, I've got this timber. Gravel is a great place to throw a tube. Uh, great for catching smallmouth specifically, but it also will catch largemouth. But what I'm gonna do is look for any of this uh, timber that I have around here, and I'm just gonna cast it out there. I'm gonna let it sink to the bottom. And once it's on the bottom, I'm gonna pop the rod a couple times and then reel up the slack. And what this is imitating is a crawfish that's trying to escape from a predator. So now I'm gonna show you how to tie on the Bitsy spin. It's, I use the same knot as I do on the Bitsy tube. I use a Palomar knot. So I loop the end of the line. I run it through the eye of the bait, tie a simple overhand knot, and then run the bait back through my loop, wet it, pull it tight, Clip the tag in and you're ready to fish. So now I'm gonna show you how to fish the Bitsy Spin. I like to look for any kind of shallow shoreline cover or any kind of boat docks like I have behind me. I just like to make short casts and steadily retrieve this. This bait imitates a minnow and it works great for any kind of small game fish. So that's a little more on how to set up and use some of the baits that come in the 33 Micro Bitsy Kit. 
For more information on this product as well as others, go to zebco.com slash academy.